academic conference. But in the future, ma'am, do you still Absolutely, want Absolutely, I am committed to continue my uh, dialogue with the government and I am committed to undertake an official visit, either by myself or with the uh, Special Rapporteur on the Right to Health, uh, because we both believe that uh, a visit together will be more helpful, more useful, more effective, uh, that we can uh, provide uh, greater um, input and insight uh, if we work together, both health and the prevention of uh, extrajudicial executions. However, I'm also ready to come by myself. I'm just waiting for the government to lift the three conditions that it has imposed on my visit. Mm -hmm. Ma'am, how did you feel about the bashing that you received yesterday? I'm used to it. You're used to it? Yeah. I'm used to it. It's a, a pity because the purpose of the forum is to open avenues of dialogue. It's to provide um, expertise, the expertise that you have heard throughout the last two days, not so much mine, but uh, Professor Hart, Professor Collins, now Pascal Touré, all of them have an incredible amount of expertise to share. And that should be the real focus, not me. Um, the real focus is what, what are the lessons to be learned from the rest of the world? What can the Philippine government, the Philippine stakeholders take from those experiences in order to build an effective response to, um, to the, 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 the drug abuse in the country, which is real, but also in order to stop the killings? That's the real story. It's the expert and the expertise. And I hope you, the media, can really report back on what the experts have told you about the situation in Mexico, in Thailand, about the learning that can be so um, uh, important for the way forward for the Philippines. I mean, we are here in a spirit of dialogue. We are here in a spirit of uh, opening avenues of communications and sharing information. I have been repeatedly told, but you don't have alternative. Of course, we have alternative. This is what the policy forum is all about. It's about presenting the options, presenting the alternatives for the Filipino uh, society, the Filipino people, the Filipino government to listen and to build upon. That's the purpose of the forum and I hope you guys can really report back on everything you've heard, the, the, the experiences, the learning, the, uh, the possibilities that um, you know the Philippines can build upon. Ma'am, what Thank learnings you. did you take away from the Philippine situation on, on drug, uh, drug use and drug abuse? I didn't come for investigation. I no, just no, came I mean, to learnings listen. From, from the, no, from the, the forum. Oh, from the presentation and from the expert, mm -hmm. I just learned what I thought uh, was the case, which is there are alternatives to the, to the current policy. There are alternatives that are based on a holistic approach, on a balanced approach, which involves the health, which involves justice, which involves policing. And I have to say the um, strategy uh, presentation yesterday from the chair of the Narcotic uh, Bureau uh, did give me hope because it's a balanced strategy that he offered. It's not in place, it's not implemented, but I think uh, the, the, the plan for the future that he wants to discuss with the, um, the government is, is a plan that is really based on what um, the lessons are from around the world, which is you need to have an integrated and holistic approach which places a lot of emphasis on health, a lot of emphasis on, on the justice sector, a lot of emphasis on preventive measures. And I think the strategy um, uh, can carry forward a different uh, policy. I will invite uh, the Narcotic Bureau Chair and others to meet with civil society as well to strengthen the proposal, to strengthen uh, the five-year plan and I will certainly invite the government to listen carefully to what the Narcotic Bureau sh uh, Chair had to say along with what civil society has to say so that we can move forward uh, you know, in, in a way that will put an end to the killings and certainly address also the real uh, issue that uh, the government is seeking to address. Mom? Thank you. Mom,